Hi, welcome to the Compensation Plan Training Series for Jeunesse Global. Advancing through the ranks in a networking opportunity is one of the most rewarding parts of the experience, but unless understood, it can also be one of the most daunting. Jeunesse features a simple to understand compensation plan with logical rank advancement milestones and clear cut objectives. The ranks are earned by successfully referring people to the Jeunesse opportunity and helping those people do the same. The Jeunesse ranks determine what amount of matching bonuses you are qualified to receive. Though it is important to understand the qualifications for all the ranks, in this video, we're only going to focus on the first four ranks and the benefits associated with them. First, some terminology. A distributor is someone who enrolls in the opportunity with the $29 starter kit and accumulates at least 100 points in personal volume during a calendar month. So basically, someone who signs up and orders a basic pack or more. Let's start with executive. To become an executive with Jeunesse, all you have to do is enroll one distributor on your left side and one on your right side. That's it. You're an executive. As an executive, you have access to the entire team commission structure, which means that you can earn up to $26,250 per week just from the first position in the plan. The next rank is that of Jade. There are two ways to become a Jade, both of which are based on personal enrollment. The first is to personally enroll four executives. The second is to personally enroll eight distributors. As a Jade, you're entitled to receive all the team commissions in addition to a first generation of matching bonuses at 20%. Following Jade is the rank of Pearl. Like Jade, there are two ways to become a Pearl, and also similar to Jade, those requirements are enrollment based. The first way to become a Pearl is by personally enrolling eight executives, and the second is by enrolling 12 distributors. Becoming Pearl qualifies you for a second generation of matching bonuses at 15%. The next rank is Sapphire. To become a Sapphire, you must have personally enrolled 12 executives. The reward for this is a third generation of matching bonuses at 10%. Now the Ruby, Emerald, and the Diamond ranks do have some volume-based requirements, but we'll cross that bridge when we get there. One mistake that many people make when looking at an opportunity is that they focus on the highest ranks first, and as a result can get discouraged when it seems like they're very far away. That having been said, let's go back and look at what can be accomplished within just the first four ranks of the Jeunesse Compensation Plan. Let's say you become an executive, and the following month each of your two people get two distributors to become executives themselves, and then each new person in the group becomes an executive the month after they came in. At the end of just one year, you'd have an organization with over 8,100 people that would be generating $14,315 a month. Let's look at Jade. If you brought in your four people and structured them so that three were on one side and one was on the other, and the exact same pattern of each new person getting two was successfully carried out, at the end of 12 months, you'd have an organization of over 20,000 people, earning a team commission check of $28,630 per month and matching bonuses of $10,020 for a total of $38,650 per month. What happens at Pearl? If you put two on one side and six on the other, and the same pattern repeated, your organization would consist of over 32,000 people, and you'd earn a team commission check of $57,300, with matching bonuses of over $37,500 monthly. That's a total of over $94,800. Let's look at Sapphire. Here's where things get a little crazy. Your organization would have over 98,000 people you'd be easily hitting the maximum team commissions of $26,250 a week, and then when you add in matching bonuses of over $72,900, you've got an income of over $177,900 per month. Remember, these scenarios are only if each new person gets two people, everyone orders a minimum auto ship of 60 points, and nothing more. There are going to be many people who get three or four or even more, Obviously, there will be some people who don't get any. But at each of these levels, ask yourself, what would happen if only 10% of the activity outlined in the scenario actually took place? You'd still be doing pretty well. This is the power of the Jeunesse Compensation Plan. It gives people the ability to change their situations and circumstances. And it also gives a clear path to make progress towards achieving these objectives. Thank you for taking the time to understand the importance of rank advancement 
in Jeunesse.